Hi everyone, I'm John Shad, Mayor of Emmitsburg. As you probably know, I'm running for re-election and would appreciate your vote on the 8th of November. There are many things that we need to be doing at Emmitsburg. Many things have been accomplished, but right now there are still things that are waiting to happen and I feel like I need the next four years to finish this job. It's very difficult to try to move forward as Emmitsburg mayor. And I can explain that by explaining that in Iowa, there are two kinds of mayors. There are strong mayors, ones that are elected by the people as we are, but also handle all the administrative work of the city. And there are quote unquote weak mayors who do not handle the administrative uh, needs of the city, but instead handle usually the PR things. I call them baby kissers. And I don't want to be that. I know that there are things that I can do that other people cannot do in this job. I know that I can make Emmitsburg a better place to live. And I feel like I really have. I've used the example of a boat on a stormy sea in the ocean. The boat is our city. And for the past several years, we've done a decent job of fixing up the boat. We've painted it. We put new sails on it. We've patched it here and there. We've done things that needed to happen to make the boat a better boat. What we haven't done is have anybody guiding that boat toward a destination. Now we have many destinations that we can go to that would be very beneficial for us and our boat. For example, people in the last few months have done surveys to determine where the economic viability of the entire world is going to be within the next 50 years. And guess where it is? It's places that produce food, number one. Number two, places that can produce energy, specifically energy that is not based on, on fuels such as coal or oil. And guess what? We have a biofuels plant right here in Emmitsburg that is thriving and going to grow bigger. And we have the ability to attract wind energy because we're in a wind tunnel that extends all the way from the Gulf of Mexico up into Canada. All three things that the experts tell us will be happening in the next 50 years can happen right here in Emmitsburg, Iowa. Of course, they can happen in other places too, but they can't happen as easily as they can here. So I'd like you to work with me in trying to use those three things. Energy in its two aspects, that being biofuels and wind, and food. What can we do as a city in order to attract industries that will be working on those 50-year goals that have been set worldwide. We're going to have a what is known politically as a meet and greet and it's going to occur on the 1st of November at our home in Emmitsburg, 601 Palmer Street. And we're going to make it more than that. We want you to come. We'd love to meet you. We'd love to greet you. We would love to get your ideas on what Emmitsburg could do. Not just what streets need to be fixed up, and that certainly is part of it. But we want to get outside the boat. We want to know what the city should be doing in the future, what kind of population we're looking for in the future, what are we looking for in terms of retail sales, do we have plans to try to get those seven empty spaces we have in our downtown facade filled with a viable business? 
what are we going to do to make Emmitsburg a better place by virtue of aiming our boat toward those things which can help us. In other words, we have a tailwind right now. Whether we do anything or not, our boat may indeed go in the right general direction, but we can help it. We'd like to see you at our home on the 1st of November. That's between 5 and 7 p.m. And we'll be serving refreshments and we'll be talking. And we'll be writing down ideas. We'd like everybody in town to be a part of that. Hope to see you there.